we move on now to a campaign controversy. It's something we're seeing more and more of these days. Thieves stealing campaign signs, and this one was caught on camera. It's video you'll see only on two tonight. Our Ryan Korsgaard live with that story. Ryan? You know, if you look around this time of year, you can see political signs just about everywhere. Well, in this case, it disappeared. Late Friday night, someone walked into Melissa Goen's front yard in the 6,000 block of Yale in North Houston with a shirt over his head and took off with a political sign for Beto O'Rourke, the Democratic candidate for U.S. Senate. We checked our security camera and we had a visitor on Friday night late, um, clearly didn't want to be detected by the camera, pulled his shirt over his head, stole the sign and walked down the street. Melissa noticed the missing sign when she went outside the next morning. She wonders how this man got into her gated neighborhood and left with a sign, dropping it as he left. I think it's a little immature, um, but I do understand that it's election season and uh, things can get pretty contentious, so uh, we're having it investigated. And it gets better. Someone has since returned the sign. It's return, not caught on camera, but the sign now back in Melissa's hands. I feel it is important for free speech and whether or not you agree with my sign, you're entitled to put up a sign that has a differing opinion. Um, and I'm not going to sneak into your yard and steal it um, because that's not how I believe people should interact with each other. Um, you can put your sign up and I'll put my sign up and then we'll see what happens on election day. And speaking of Election Day, she says she'll probably leave the sign down for right now and wait until it gets closer to Election Day. We're live tonight. Ryan Korsgaard, KPRC, Channel 2 News.